Alright, uh, what's up guys? I'm back with another video. Now today I'm on NBA Mobile 19, guys. Now I did reach 600 subscribers, but a separate video will be coming tomorrow for that. Cause I was gonna do it today, but I'm gonna postpone it till tomorrow. Cause I haven't uploaded in a few days, so um yeah, so this video is are pro packs worth it? Now just by using common sense, most people would say no. But I'm here with the math. To let you know the factual evidence of whether Pro Packs are actually worth it or not. So they did an update pretty recently where it's a 4% chance to get an 87 plus overall. So 4% chance. So if you open 25 Pro Packs, that is a 100% chance to get 87 plus. By, what, by the information that they give you. So if you open 25 packs, you're going to get an 87 plus. At least one. So right there automatically so but each pro pack is 7500 so if you're gonna open 25 pro packs to get a hundred percent chance of an 87 plus that's 187k 187,500 coins right there to get 25 pro packs and you're going to open five a day so yeah so 187k for a 87 plus that most of them go for like 16k or 25k. Let's check. I'm pretty sure you can find some for like 16k. 87. Yeah, look, there's three right there for 16k. But 25k, you'll find like a bunch of them easily. Yeah, look at that. A bunch of them. So, 187,000 coins. For a guaranteed 87 plus, that's going to make you only 20, 20k coins at most, 25k at most. So, yeah, but you never know because you can get lucky because the 87 plus, so you can get like 90s or like 88s, 89, 90s. So, but the final test is to actually open the packs themselves. So, first pro pack here. See what we can get with this. Okay, double gold. Double gold for that one. Let's try the next one. Ooh! Ooh! We get an 89 overall. 89 overall. The Kembe Matumbo. I might do a gameplay on this card just because just I pulled it. What the heck? What's this block? 90 block. Get that out of here. No, no, no. Not today. I might do a gameplay on this card. Ooh, I did not expect to pull that. So that was insane. Let me take a screenshot of that real quick. So, I mean, sometimes you can get lucky, though. That's the thing. Oh, I click update team backs in it. So, yeah, that's the thing about pro packs that um, you might just get lucky. You might just get lucky. So, see, next one we get a gold. So, I don't know what pro pack. I think this is the fourth one, I'm pretty sure. I don't know. I lost count. Okay, yeah, this is definitely the last one right here. So the last pro pack, what can we get out of this one? All right, Larry Nance Jr. and a PJ Tucker. So five pro packs, we get an 89 overall card. So let's go ahead and check how much we wasted. Um... All right, so we opened five pro packs. So we wasted 37K, 37,500 coins. For a card that goes for over 90,000 coins. So right there we made profit. We made easy profit. So yeah guys we made e easy 50k profit right there. Just on those 5 pro packs alone. So that's insane. I did not expect to pull such a fire pull like that. I didn't expect to pull anything like that. That is an insane pull. I mean for pro packs. Because I've opened so many pro packs throughout the season. This season uh, specifically. And i gotten barely anything so i think that's my best pull from a pro pack so far so that was insane so you never know guys it's all up to you whether you think pro packs are worth it or not because luck like no matter how much math i do here you know luck can just change anything anything and everything especially in life and in nba live mobile so it's up to you guys whether or not you think they're worth it let me know in the comments down below what your best pool is in pro packs and if you think they are worth it or not so i'll see you guys in the next one i'm gone don't forget to like and subscribe peace